Let's welcome in the management at the Music Broadcast, Mr. R K Agarwal, Group Chief Financial Officer at Jagran Prakashan, is now with us. Uh, how have the numbers been, sir? What are the highlights of Q1? What is the outlook on revenue going ahead? Absolutely right, you are. What has contributed to this uh, robust performance for Q1 uh, is, uh, of course, a rate hike in 12 core markets together. It has never been done. It has always been done in phases. But this time, we took rate hike in all 12 core markets. As you understand, the market conditions are not yet very conducive. But still, we went ahead with our strategy decided in the beginning of the year. Number two was, in fact, uh, tremendous traction which uh, phase three stations received. It has helped us in two ways. Number one is uh, inventory utilization improved beyond our ex expectations, which in turn contributed straight away to EBITDA. Number two is what we thought probably uh, we'll have to incur to, you know, uh, uh, promote these stations, that cost was saved. So it helped us in two ways, and as a result, we were expecting, in fact, to you know, start generating uh, money from these new stations, say, two years hence from now. In fact, it has happened two years earlier. This is what it speaks, you know, volumes about the strength of the brand. Mr. Agarwal, your margins have been particularly healthy. Do you believe a 30% plus level is something that you can sustain going forward? 33 plus is uh, never a problem. And uh, if we report, you know, 34, I'll not be surprised for all of this. What has been your advertising volume growth now? What is your outlook on the volumes? Uh, see, whenever you take rate hike, uh, uh, volume growth may not be very significant, but we are very, very happy with our uh, volume as well as, you know, yield growth, which is divided 50-50 in 8% growth. So we are pretty, you know, happy about it. And uh, it went strictly according to the strategy, what we had decided in the beginning of the year. Also, take us through the details of your share buyback plan and what will be your balance sheet position uh, post that? Balance sheet continues to be very, very robust. In fact, you know, you have net worth of 600 crore. Your balance sheet is hardly leveraged, right? And what you are distributing is just 70% of cash generated from your operations in the year 2017-18. You know, this is not very high capex business. What we need capital for is to look for, you know, inorganic growth opportunity. The kind of balance sheet you have, the kind of liquidity you have, you can look for any inorganic growth opportunity, you know, 1,000 growth without breaking the ice. Right. Uh, can you, uh, you know, can you also, you know, just tell us about the delivery of the ROE at 10.7% over the past 12 months? Fact is, you know, as Jagrat, we are not happy with 10.7% ROE, right? Uh, as you know, the parent, you know, delivers, you know, upward of 20%. That is what is our target, right? And that is where we uh, intend to reach. And I'm sure within the next three years' time, we'll touch that today. Thanks so much, Mr. Agarwal, uh, for telling us uh, about what uh, music broadcast declared and what uh, did you make of it. Uh, on that note, we're taking a break. Coming